Oh man, I'm down to 13. Hi guys, I'm Raging Diesel, and welcome to another hardcore episode of The Infected. Now in our last episode, during our live stream, we completed some of the exterior walls of the build, also finishing a few more items to complete the build. Then we went out on an adventure to go ahead and get electrical parts for the rest of the build. While out there during one of the raids of the POIs, we ended up dying to a Vambi by being overly aggressive. So for the official rules, the season is over. But with a little bit of uh, persuasion from uh, the live stream audience, they told me to go ahead and continue the build and move on to toward the season finale. So what I plan on doing is the next three episodes, this Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, we're going to go ahead and finish the build, and I'll give you short episodes on updates on the completion. I'll do a lot in between episodes, and I'll sh show you how I completed it in each one. So I did a, a little bit in between this episode. I added a little more cement to this, because this is all, all this wood here is on this, this level here is going to be cement. We'll keep this wood but we're going to move this to cement. And I built these, I finally built up these fences here and they're ready to be upgraded. So I brought the cement and the steel here with us and we'll go ahead and take that taken care of. This should be enough. Also, I put a few more spike traps here, just around the corner. Bear, we don't need you today. So that's the cement, that all we need. I've been working on cement as much as I could in between episodes, so we got a little bit extra than what we needed. And I'm going to hold on to that before doing to this, because we might have some more of these stone paths to, to finish. I'm not sure. So that's there. Got a little bit of extra steel in case we need it, but I don't know if we'll need any more. So the entryway is complete. Now I've been working around the exterior. Like I said, during the, during the live stream, we started on this by putting the, the blue brick walls where the foundations are to make it look more up, up to date. And I've been working my way around, making sure I got everything covered. And I'm not sure what I want to do here or not, whether or not I should fill that in. Let me know in the comments. Should I leave it like this or should I go ahead and fill it in like everything else? I kind of like it because it looks like a big battlement. So, oh, I'm stuck. And I've continued all the way around. And only missing a couple spots here. And I'll show you how I completed it in case you missed it during the live stream. What you end up doing, depending on this type of wall, you have to put the type of wall the foundation's on, that's on the exterior. So this one is actually a corner wall and we're going to need some logs for this let's go ahead and grab some i do have some extra runos over here now what we do is you place Another wall, you have to bend the pen corner walls on this. So now the wall, the cover above it. And I need planks. Let's go grab some real quick. I didn't think I'd be going through using that many planks. Might as well grab a handful.
grab as many as we can. Keep these full. That should be enough. We have to keep an eye out. I think we're still short, I think, a goat and a deer to finish this off. We want to place one animal in each spot, and I'll need a goat and a deer. We got the raccoon. We have a sheep. And over there, we got the fox. So all we need is the goat and the deer to get. So if we see one, we'll go ahead and make sure we get it. Now that that's done, put that in, and then, oh, that's a half wall. Dog. You have to put a full wall or it won't stack underneath it. I did it, almost did it again. Full wall. <laughs> then you place one underneath. Now it, if you look down here, it's now underneath it flush. And once you place it, you can delete this, get some of your items back. Need more, two more logs. Let's see if Mike has helped us out over here. Not yet, but I do have a couple carts over here. Because I thought I'd be doing work here. Oh, that's not good. Where are we at here? Oh, I'm over. Like I can really walk on barbed wire. And then with the planks, go to walls, corner wall, brick, ask for the blue brick. Oh, we're out of bricks. Do I have any bricks in here? No. All right. It's, I didn't expect this. <laughs> Luckily, we still have a little more bricks. I've been going through them and reloading them as we go. And I've been kind of bouncing around. As you can see, what I decided to do is go ahead and make this walkway go all the way to the stairs. It kind of makes it a little more symmetrical. I think it looks better that way. Uh, we'll get to that today. We needed bricks. So we're going to grab a little bit of dry bricks. Hopefully that's enough. And like I said, I've been reloading the bricks as we go. And in between episodes, I'll fill this up again. The other thing I've been doing is adding more iron, copper, cobalt. And I did have steel. Like I said, I had made up all the steel that we had. And what I want to do before we finish make sure all the shelves are filled so if I have to go run to the mine in between episodes that's what I'll do to make sure it's all filled up I gotta figure out where I'm going here all right here Looks like I have another one right here. Same thing. Place a full one. Make sure it's full. Drag a, drag a cart with us. Hopefully Michael keep these full. I wanted to show you just a couple different ways that we've done it.
Hopefully this is enough. And then... Place another wall below it. Add the logs. And delete this one. Come on. And upgrade it. Now, this is just a flat wall piece. So instead of that, you just place a regular wall. Just put an interior wall on top. It doesn't matter if it's a regular wall or an interior wall. You decide which wood or it. To me, it's easier because I can just have the, the planks with me. Delete this one. And regular flat wall and the blue brick and there. Hope that isn't too loud. I'll turn this down just a tad. And as you can see, I did see where the stair goes. I did decide to put a wall here so it makes it look a little better and it works like a railing, so I think it looks better that way. And some of the, you know, stone paths will peek through. And I think that looks good. But I got it to all wrap around all the way. And I got about halfway. Now, in between episodes, I'll work on this some more. And we'll continue that up a little more. But you see how I did it. And we've got more to do down here. Like so, I might end up doing that wall thing here. I don't know. That kind of looks good, but I put changed all these to stone path because it looks better underneath now, and it looks like it fits in better. Put some of the, some of these bricks over here underneath. So that's pretty much all I've done for the exterior walls. But. I've, I kind of like the way I've kind of walked the, uh, the outside and there's some gaps where there isn't doubled, where they're not doubled up, where the spike traps aren't doubled up, like right here. And what I'll do is I'll end up putting some more in place. And kind of sorting it out. It might that might take take me a full day in itself. But these I will have to go the rest. We're only about halfway around. As you can see, so I'll work in between episodes to fill these in. Try to get the spike traps looking a little more. Oh, looks like I could use a bite. That'll get us till we're done here. All the lights are all done. And speaking of lights, I built an extra fireplace. And I put it up over here on top of the power. Now in a future episode, we're going to line this all with oil lamps. Hopefully I'll have enough fish. If not, I'll go out and catch some more. But I put one here, and what I'm thinking, placeables, uh, no, construction others. And we're going to put we'll put these roofs over it. And I 
I think it only takes three logs. Hopefully that's all it does. That way... Oh, it takes four. Okay, we'll get another log up in here, but that way we can light a fire up here, and when it's lit up at night, at least you'll see it. I don't think if you put oil lamps here, you're going to see them from a distance, but you'll light the walkway will be lit. But that'll make this area complete. This is pretty much done the way I, I think it's going to be. I put these angled pieces during the live stream in. So now it kind of looks finished. And the railings. These don't need railings with these here. So I'm not going to put them like that. Only if they're exposed. So that's the, the exterior. I'm not putting any exterior lights because the light lights from the windows will shine out. If I put too many, I would have. During the live stream, I placed the ghost imprints for the kitchen area. And in between episodes, I went and added, added the planks to make the exterior walls and upgraded them. And it just takes planks to do that. So that makes the kitchen complete. And even with this light right there in the corner, the light kind of shines through here. We have light here and here. So it lights up in here in the kitchen and we have enough light on the outside. Now, I'm gonna need logs. So I'm gonna grab one of them log carts Because we got a few more things to do for the end of this episode. I had to take out the stairs to get underneath them. So what I did is I just took these foundations out and I'm going to put... Try to get it to match up properly. Doesn't want to move. <laughs> it's shifting back and forth. There. And make sure you go down. And these take four wood logs, two cement, and sandstone. So I'm going to grab some of the extra sandstone we have in here. Hopefully that's enough. <laughs> that's why I was bringing that cart with me all around. I figured I'd need all that cement that I used. Okay, there's the cement. We'll go ahead and throw the extras back in here. Put the dry bricks away. And we'll go grab some logs. With this being up like this now, it's easy to grab logs right from here. Mike does have to have a problem loading loading the ones in the middle on. So what I want to do is keep those full. Um, one log short. That's been the 
whole part of this build this year is we've always been one short. I'm going to need more anyway. Um, placeable, no constructions. I need to put the stairs in. Three more logs and that'll be done. See, Mike's caught up to us. Oh, we need to get a bite to eat. Check on our animals. So we're going to go ahead and grab... I got three ration packs here. Looks like we're down pretty well. So we'll eat one of these. See if we can get ourselves back up to 104 in health. That topped us off. And go ahead and get a drink. And we'll take care of our... Ooh. If I... Take all. I can empty out one. And throw the excess away. Oh. And just discard it. Make sure our animals are taken care of here. And we've got more eggs and milk that we can know what to do with. So now that we've got extra biofuel, it's kind of like what I've been doing all, all day. I've been kind of running around in circles. When I run out of one material, I'll, I'll work on another project. And these, I just topped off, but now that I got the, I'll just go ahead and top off Let those keep running. Put the I, now I've made an extra cart here to put here. It, that way I know I don't have to keep running back and forth. So that's that's the entryway quit complete. Kind of wish they had like I wish they would make like a candelabra or something that would make that entryway just go I still have to make these lights and I'm pretty sure now that I'm just going to go with one in the middle and I'm pretty sure now I'm going to have to go with one here in the middle and not these so if I can get that we'll grab our friend I mean and we'll delete that. Over here. Delete that one. And we'll just have the one here in the middle. But instead of that, I'm thinking we'll put that overhead lamp here just like we have before. Placeables, others. Um, placeables, power. No, furniture, lighting. There we go. Place that there. And see if we can wire this into the uh, downstairs lights. Uh... We need one copper, three iron, one glass, and two electrical parts. One copper, three iron, two 
two glass, and two electrical parts. Hopefully we're going to have enough to finish. We've got 12 left. And like during the live stream, we finished... When we got back with our electrical parts, we finished both these... This floor with all the lights. They're all complete. I'm going to put oil lamps in here, I think. So these are all done. And I'm thinking this might be the TV room. We'll place the TV here along with another couch. And we'll take care of that during the season finale. That'll finish that one off. And this will just be like a sitting room. Now I did have one of our uh, our viewers tell me that this was hanging off the edge. Let's see if we can fix that. Does it make any difference? Yeah. Even though it's not going to go there? Heck, why not? Um, where were we? Going down one floor. This shouldn't be that hard to do. TV. Kind of look like where it's centered. Let's see if it's hanging out the back. Oh, it's, I think that's perfect. Do some furniture. See if we have enough to put make this couch. And a couple matching chairs. Now that I see that. These chairs fit better. coffee table here and we'll add a couple other pieces of furniture during the, the live stream let's just figure out what chairs would work up here with this maybe these kind of recliner looking chairs they take cloth so we should be able to put these together it would work one here one here. That's kind of small. Hmm. Uh, maybe you should put another one. But I'm going to put them, like, right in between. I don't know. 
Let me know what you think. I want to be able to get back and forth. So we might move this all back here a little. And then when we make them, we'll move them back so we have a, a freeway through here. Hi, guy. Uh, we still have to wire this up, but we'll be getting that toward that. We have to wire that one and that one, and we have to plumb this up, and we have a couple rugs to make. So we'll be working on that. But I wanted to get this light finished. We didn't get two electrical parts. We needed two. So that should make the light. I have some wire here. Oh, I must have put it away. And see if we can wire all that up. We should be able to. And we're going to need one, at least one, uh, placeables, power. There. That needs screws, iron. Can't get to it. That should work. One iron, one copper, four screws. I'm going to need another wire. Let's uh, get that done before we finish here today. Wire. One copper, one plastic, one copper. One copper. Plastic. One oil. I think that's enough. something to stand on here. Hopefully we can reach that. Can I pull a wire from here? Now it's the metal gate. Hmm. There, we got it now. We'll pull the wire. Go to here. And pull the wire. Straight to this, and there you go. And it should be on the same circuit as this. Oh, and off and on. There we go.
pretty much now the, the bottom floor is totally complete. We've got rugs. Kitchen's complete. This area's complete. Now, like I said, I'm going to try to fill up these, these ingot shelves. So in between episodes, I might end up going to the mine, grabbing more ore, just to fill them up. And I'll be working on the exterior to finish that. And then we'll move on to the finishing the second and third floors. But that's all the time we're going to have for today. Quick, quick, short video just to make sure we get things done and show you how I'm completing them. And make sure you come to the live stream on Wednesday night because that'll be the season finale. And you'll not only see the complete build uh, for season four, but you'll also get a quick glimpse of what happened during seasons one, two, and three. I'll show you the finishing builds there. So if you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe for future content. Don't forget to ring the bell and comment down below. You know, I love your comments. They give me great feedback and they help the channel grow. So until next time, this is Raging Diesel saying, keep the shiny side up. Goodbye, everybody. <laughs>